we're recording? We are now, yeah. Good morning, fight, guys. Good morning, guys. It is morning. Did you wear anything from the spinny whilst thinking on? Yes, those pipes. Adjustable pipes. So yeah, now we're on the way back. On the way back is fine with me. Yes, so, I'm just going to Norwich. Well, folks, it's stunning again. We've been We've really been very lucky. lucky with the weather, haven't we? Yeah, really lucky. I'm looking a bit worse for wear. It's because I'm struggling with my ribs. So we're going to Norwich today, and our aim is to get what is it to get there? Dog food. Oh yeah. The biggest thing is dog food. Yeah, puppy doggy food. And then one or two bits and pieces. Across the road, it's no avoid it. I know you couldn't, darling. I know you couldn't. But if you annoy me, you might have to avoid one or two less. Uh, <laughs> charming. Right, so anyway, we're on our way to Northwich. We're going to get some little bins and bits and pieces. Dog food. It's a beautiful day, so the last thing we want is to be riding around all day, so we might find a pub for some lunch because it's just Mike and I tonight. We've actually got a night on our own. Yeah. yeah Ooh, that's that's a funny looking tractor. You don't know what it is? You don't know what that tractor is? No, it's a sprayer. You don't know what one is? Oh, no, she's failed. It must be on farming simulator 19, not farming simulator 17. <laughs> I play a game occasionally <laughs> called farming simulators. During lockdown, <laughs> Donna discovered the Xbox. And she tried Minecraft, she tried um, <laughs> Civilization, Revolutions, Revelations or whatever it was. Um, and then, Which is quite And good. then she found Farming Simulator 17, which she really, really enjoyed. Yeah, ooh, ah, ooh, ah. I like being a farmer. <laughs> yeah, so I now know tractors. <laughs> Not all, but I know some. Part of the things that happened in lockdown stayed in lockdown. <laughs> A lot of people yeah. were bored and had things to do and houses to paint and those who didn't have things they could do had to try and find things to stimulate your mind. And, that was and a lot of them. people turned to computers, so it was it. Yeah. No, that's not fair. I was always into the Xboxes and Playstations and Mega Drives. I started off in the early 90s, been into them. Never stopped really. Both my kids were raised with them. Who remembers the Boogie Man Pick and Flick Adventure? Michael used to love that. <laughs> Whereas my boys were brought up in Spain and everything was outdoors. Swimming, cycling, playing in the streets with the friends. Old school. Yeah. Pardon me, keep you on it today, don't know why. In fact, they only actually ever got a computer when we got back here.
so, back. Yeah, I do. So I hope you're having a good one. I hope it's nice and sunny where you are. And if you're on a, a caravan holiday somewhere, let us know where you've been and tell us if it's any good and we can have a mooch and see if we can get there one day. And until then, bye for now. We most of the time, so hey, you don't have to tell people that. <coughs> oh dear, <coughs> trying to cough. <coughs> don't know what was the cough. <coughs> Can we bash it back? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if you bash him back. <laughs> yeah, if you want. Or if you want me to bash your throat, it'll be fucked. <laughs> yeah. Can I see coffee? Yeah. <coughs> Are you looking for a bloody Costa? I know it's a Costa, I'm not the Costa. <laughs> a drive through parking bay well I don't know but they seem to be parking in the parking bay so in the drive through parking bay yes yeah. Xmas shop really at this hour this time <laughs> sorry babe I know it's not your I fault it's not no your I didn't fault. know it was a lesson <sighs> gee would I, why would I <sighs> some book in my parking space oh right well we can put sit out with the doggos Well, we didn't give you any useful information on that little John. <laughs> Absolutely useless. Yeah, well, well, coffee took over. I'm sorry, guys. The need for coffee was somewhere to sit with doggies and doggies and drink took over. What can I say? We'll see you later. Well, we're sat outside Costa in Northwich. It's beautifully sunny. But we're waiting for them to come and put the umbrella up because both the pups are out with us and they're sat having a tubo and they've got some water so at least they're sitting out the car Mike's just gone to get us a coffee and hopefully a little sausage roll then goes our pub lunch oh. Hi folks! Hi folks! Donald's have to cook because I swore my mistake well, it's quarter past one, yeah. and we're heading back towards the Stiddy. Stiddy? We've, we've got Stiddy. more stuff for the caravan. I reckon we need Pickford's removals, not a bloody caravan. Um, I only really want to go and see what's in here, not that they don't need anything. I was going to say, you've had a Costa for I know, but it just says it's, it's a little area, so I want to go see what the area is. So we've got, in the back, we've Tissue got one of those park. tall upright air uh, Fans. Fans, because it gets hot in that caravan and the one thing that we haven't got in it, which is a big thing for me, is we haven't got aircon. So, um... I thought it was a Hoover. <laughs> <laughs> That's new, isn't it? Weaver's whistle. No, it isn't. You've been there. You've met the, uh -huh. um, Alan there for lunch. Oh, yeah, we did, didn't we? Yeah. Uh, anyway, Maybe. so we've got that. Come on. Uh, one thing Pays and we've up. also got uh, an animal vax hair, hair dryer hoover Calm for the spare. caravan one that just shrinks into nothing these new built yeah i know we've just come back from the back end of norwich going up to our knotsford um, and mike's doing a tour past b q and curry's up that road so i think we might have to go on that way stuff. way bridge and see how much we actually do weigh and we need a plate upgrade that's a definite now because by the time we finished buying everything, sticking it all in the caravan. By the time we finished buying, mm. we is this the royal we? Well, yeah, it is the royal we because you bought another um, fan before I even. Yeah, but I bought the fan for the awning for the dogs to keep them cool, not for the caravan itself because I knew you wanted a special one that was small for the caravan. Sarcastic thing then. So I just got a desktop one that'll blow loads, just move the air around for the puppies. But anyway, I'm going to turn you around now and you can have a look at the remainder of our journey back. And Through Lower Peora. And we're hopefully Peora. going to be st stopping at 
um, Seven Sisters ice cream place. I love my ice cream. Posh, posh ice cream. And so far, I haven't had any ice cream. Or Telefib, I had some raspberry ripple on my brownie the other day. And I had some vanilla ice cream yesterday on chocolate fudge cake. So, yeah. I want ice cream, ice cream now. So, we'll speak to you in a little bit, folks. Enjoy your day. because I would. We're going to take you. Wow, pink paradise here. Yeah, they're cute. Oh, the tables are lovely, yeah. Look, now, who doesn't agree with that saying? Life is better with ice cream. It's so cute. Yeah, the tables are lovely, aren't they? It's a nice little seating area outside as well. Wow, this is so cute. Right in the middle of the countryside. Let me just peep you outside. Do you have anywhere that you want something? Do you have any more stations? Nice. Okay. Seven Sisters Posh Ice Cream. Double hot cross buns. Yeah. Take your time, right? She's like, I'm a real ice cream person. Oh, even before? No. Cream. Afternoon. I had I coffee. I had lemon meringue ice cream and <laughs> and, and something else. Uh, cherry cheesecake with sherbet. I haven't had sherbet on it for, since I was a little girl, and I'm still eating it. So it was really scrummy. Yeah. So this is called. The Seven Sisters Posh Ice Cream. You can actually um, order online, it says there. Yeah, and it's it's very nice. It's at the farm, but very, very good. Wednesday to Saturday, 11 till 5. Sunday, 11 till 4. Open bank holidays. And it's on, what road is this, babe? The A50. The main A50 road from Nutsford to... Holmes Chapel. Holmes Chapel nice really nice so if you're in this area definitely pop by especially if you've got children because they've also got like a play area there for them so it's quite nice quite sweet so we'll see you in a minute Whoop, because we're shooting out now well, i've got a gap in the traffic. the traffic and i shall continue to eat my yummy ice cream speak to you in a minute real 